Hello, welcome back to Trails of Gold Steel 2, where the NPCs in this town like to stop in their tracks just because I'm here. Reen, not only is everybody's favorite in Trista, but oh my god. Uh oh no. This is somewhat, this is somewhat frightening. Alright, well. Th there you go, there we go, he's on a track. He's got places to be. He knows where he's going. Hello. Oh. Hey, Kenneth. And Annabella, too. Or Annabelle, I mean. Oh, no. Are these the anglers? Oh, jeez. It's good to see you again, Reen. So, you saw a request? I saw it, yeah. I wasn't quite sure what it was, actually. Or what it was actually requesting though. Mind clearing things up for me? Oh, I guess that makes sense since you've been away from Trista for so long. Whoa, where should I start? Uh, I'm sorry, this is really all my fault. <laughs> Come on! You know that's not true, my brother's just being a pain. Yep, still lost. I guess I've gotta fill you in on a few things though. So basically, our parents set up an arrangement or arranged marriage between Annabelle and my brother. Really? That's right. Her family's been harassing her about when she's actually going to walk down the aisle, though. As you can imagine, she's not exactly thrilled about it all. If I may be so bold as to interject. Lady Annabelle was not even informed of this arrangement until after it had been declared and agreed upon. As one would expect, she was thoroughly shocked when she was when she found out. She even went so far as to run away from home, which in turn had a stark effect on her once elegant personality. I had no idea. Well, I have been gone for nearly a year. I feel as though some of the fault rests on my shoulders as well. As such, should the engagement's cancellation become real, uh, realizable, I will do everything I can to make that happen. Wait, are you saying it's possible to call all this off? It may be, obviously. The first thing I, um, I did was ask my parents to call things off, but they wouldn't listen. Their only response was, It wouldn't do to insult a man of the Empire for no good reason. Whatever that means. So, with that escape route closed, I figured I'd try to go and uh, go to the man himself and see if he'd call things off. My brother, Charmer that he is, wasn't having any of that. He gave us a similar line about nobles not going back on their promises, and that was that. I imagine his great, uh, his greatest concern is our respect to, respective families' social stat statuses. The head of the Lake Lord family is only a bird, uh, a baron, while my father is a viscount. I get it. He's worried that not going through with the wedding would be an insult to a family of higher status, huh? This kind of stuff makes upper-class society a real pain sometimes. You're telling me. Marriages of status and convenience often take precedence over those of love among the nobility. That much is true. But, for my part, I wish for nothing more than Lady Annabelle's happiness. And this arrangement certainly isn't that. So, with that in mind, I, uh, I decided to ask uh, to my brother one more time. Or talk to my brother one more time. That's the, that's the word. Eventually, we managed to reach a very Lake Lord compromise. We'll settle this with an old noble tradition. The fishing battle. Aha! Now we get it. Fishing battles are split into two parts, right? Obviously, the main events between the two actual challengers, or captains in this case. But before that, their chosen vice captain face off. 
So that means it took you a while to get there, but you got it. Esteemed captain, I'd like to fish as my vice captain. I'd like you to fish as my vice captain. I'd ask Annabelle to compete, but that seems kind of wrong. I don't know. Yeah, I figured as much. You guys have both done a lot for me, so I'd be happy to help, but do you really think I'm up for this? I mean, Annabelle's future is online, and I finished with you, uh, with you enough to, wait, I fished with you enough to quake in my boots when I hear the name Lake Lord. Uh, I think I've seen a fishing rod before once, probably. Look, don't worry about it. Miracles happen all the time. I'm not going to pressure you into doing it or anything, though. So if you want to pre uh, pass, just pass. Still, what do you say? Let's fish. Why not? Let's go fishing. I don't know if I'm up, for, up to stuff. Up to snuff, I mean. But if you believe in me, maybe I've got this. Thank you so much. You have my humblest thanks for doing this for Lady Annabelle. You've definitely got this. Together. We're going to save Annabelle from this wedding of hers. I know we will. <laughs> so grateful to the both of you uh, for helping me out like this. Ah, ah, dropping the controller. Oh, are we just going? Oh, no. Roughly ten minutes passed. Eventually, Lake Lord III and his vice captain emerged and began making their way towards them. Oh my goodness. Well, look who it is. It's been a while. Humph. <laughs> you haven't changed a bit. Still as lively as your bait, I see. How splendificent. Wait, spl splendificent. Okay. I instantly hate you. <gasps> It is to meet you and to speak with you again, Kenneth. <laughs> Good to see you in high spirits, Narcissus. So, what do you say we dive right in? No sense in lollygagging. This spot will do, I suppose. Fish or Trista, fish of Trista, rejoice, for I have returned to grace your waters with my line once more. And then we push him into the water. So that's the heir of the Lake Lord family. He definitely seems a lot more noble than you do. No offense. But how's he already familiar with the fishing spots around here? <laughs> well, he is a Thor's grad. Oh, right. I guess if he loved fishing as much as you do, then he'd probably know the city from back to front. But what in the world is that uniform? Lady Annabelle. How simply splendid it is to see her again. I hope that you will be suitably entertained by the spectacle that is about to unfold before you. The thanks. I'm sorry that my selfishness made you come all the way out here. Please, there's no need to apologize. This is entirely the fault of my foolish brother needlessly compli complicating things. I swear on my family's name that I will defend our marriage. There is no need to worry your pretty little head. Yeah. So, I surmise that you are Kenneth's vice captain. Who am I? I am the deli delightacular and styliferous gentleman Narcissus, though you might know me by my alias, the, cr the Crazy Wave. Not only do I hail from the Imperial Fishing Club, led by Lake Lord III, I am one of its equis exquisitant Elite Four. Allow me to offer you my most enthusiastic con contrafabularities. Words are hard <laughs> on being chosen to face me today. May your battle be splend... <sighs> Splintiff. You know what? You know what? I've changed my mind. Instead of using my fishing pole to fish, 
I'm just going to shove it firmly up your ass and use you as my bait. Okay. Good. Uh, I'll uh, do my best, too, I think. What a com commender is com commend the Taurus attitude. Mark my words, young man. You will go far. Did they pay this guy to be the wor- to- <laughs> Did they pay this guy by the word or something? <laughs> well, now that we've exchanged our greetings, I'll get right to explain the rules. The goal is to- Sorry, my brain just shut off for a second there. The goal of each part of the battle is the same. Uh, catching a designated fish first, the vice captain will compete. The team whose vice captain catches their, fir their fish first will enjoy the advantage of starting the second round early. I see. Sounds like a fair battle f uh, format to me. Any skilled angler should be able to guide a capable vice captain, after all. The outcome of this battle will determine the fate of our arranged marriage. Are you absolutely certain you wish to proceed with this Lady Anvil? I am. I am prepared to accept the outcome no matter what it may be. If you're sure. In that case, we're going to fish like we've never fished before and make sure you're happy. Oh, by the way, that fish will be, uh, will be ca catchy, wait, the fish, we, will, wait, oh, sorry, okay, I read ahead, and I forgot that the, it's not that, it's what, and, sorry, it's just, that Narcissus guy really got to me, and my brain is just all jumbled up, and just, it's crazy, it's just a crazy, wasteland of thoughts and words <laughs> and exhaustion oh by the way what fish will we be catching all right our vice captains will be attempting to catch a noble carp i assume you were being uh, rhetorically rhetor pfft, rhetorical when you asked what we'd be catching the giant sword tail is the only acceptable choice. Ah. Going after the big guy, huh? The most elusive fish in Trista. I've heard the rumors myself. A huge 250 rage sword tail who survived decades of battles. If we caught him, we'd be able to stuff our faces for two whole weeks and still have some left over. Lady Annabelle, please. If you wouldn't mind acting a little more like a lady of the nobility. Maybe very much appreciated at this delicate time. <laughs> now that's the Annabelle I know. Well, like you said, you're going to be catching a noble carp. Also, I thought this video was going to be me finishing that stupid side quest with the pawn shop. Not the pawn shop, the flea market. But now I'm fishing. And the video is almost like the video is like three quarters of the way done. This is not how I expected anything to go. You can use all the ground baits you'd like, but I don't know how much you have on you. Here, take some of mine. Ground bait, I got five. Thanks. This will really come in handy. You can leave the area before you catch your fish, but you'll be in trouble if they catch theirs first. So don't wander off. Nah. No sightseeing tours for me. I guess I should get started. Good luck, Green. We, we will be gr quietly, respectfully cheering you. <laughs> Thanks, Butler. <laughs> Thanks, Butler Kerrigan. <laughs> I see you've come. Complimented your preparations. Well then. Let the battles commence. May the best men win. Vice captains, assume your positions. Would it really be disqualification if I pushed him in the water? And begin. Huh. 
Round one, advice Captain Bells. Control a reed and catch a ma uh, yeah, cool. I wanna I wanna do some fishing. Yeah. Yes. I got a hit. What what's happening? Why is it to do this? <laughs> there we go. What did I get? I caught that wasn't what I was getting. The ACP. I wanna change my rod. I can't change my rod. Alright, cool fish. Woo! That's a hit. Uh, ah, the power of fishing. Ah. Now that's catch. That's not what I'm going for, but thanks. Go for it. Huh. Woo! This is all this episode's going to be, isn't it? Oh, cool. Uh, uh, keep going! So close! I have made it! I've caught myself a fishy! Uh, more. Is this what death feels like? It's probably what death feels like. Uh, it's the same fucking fish! I haven't had to do this in a while. <laughs> now that's a catch. Yay. Cool. Please let this be the one. Yeah. It's not though. Just keep going. Keep going. Just keep it up. Just, 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 just go. Now that's a catch. Uh, use ground bait. Huh. Yeah. It's the same fucking fish. It's not the noble, noble carp that they want me to catch. Now that's a catch. It's not what I'm coming for, though. I have no idea what I'm doing. What am I doing? Alright. After casting your lore, press circle. When it disappears, a fish will bite. Really in the fish, after you get the bite, if you just. If, if, Going for a specific fish, right? Well, it's not this one. I know it's not this one. I super know it's not this one. Uh... <laughs> should I just use a different rod? I feel like I should use a different rod. No, that's not what I want. No, what are you doing? Game? Buttons? <sighs> now that's a catch. I don't have a different rod. <laughs> I lost the fish. Yay. If I can do this, 
Am I just stuck here forever? And never. And forever. It's just my life now. now that's where I live. Um. Hey, Rain, been keeping up with your fishing lately. Sometimes I guess I haven't really had a lot of opportunities lately, though, but you. This is really a stupid conversation to have in the middle of this. Alright, you know, you're probably right. Oh, yeah, I'm pretty sure you were doing this with Annabelle, but you can also change your angular points with me now. Once you re feel like trading some in. Oh. Oh, oh. D does that mean that I can, like... I, I can buy a new fishing pole? No? Alright! It's pretty great. Did you give me the same things? Alright. I appreciate it. Um. Oh, it's in the same area too, isn't it? That's cool. Fucking fish. Ah! Huh. Uh, what the fuck? What the? What's happening? Some sort of cruel joke. I finally get the damn thing, and it's gonna slip past my fingers. <laughs> this is a big one. <laughs> I don't fucking care. I did. I got one. The uh, past trouble has someone finally conquered the crazy wave. The winner of the vice captain battles Master Reed. Woo! Most impressive, you chose your second well, it seems. Well, Thoris has some pretty big fish nowadays, so I figured I'd show a little school spirit, you know? How <laughs> did you know? I presume you mean to imply that your angler bi angling abilities now surpass my own. We'll find out soon enough, won't we? Night we shall. Phew! Nice to know I didn't let our side down, at least. <laughs> Not a chance with fishing like that. Wow. Wow. I am so tired. Oh, that took everything out of me. Oh, I hated it. You made that look like shooting fish in a barrel. That's a little extreme, don't you think? Narcissus is obviously really good at this. I'm sure he'll catch his in a minute. Ta-ta. Magniferous. The embodiment of... You just not with your words. I'm just gonna give you a swift kick in the back. Just pa! Into the water. Narcissus caught his fish three minutes after your vice captain caught his, which means you get a three minute head start, Kenneth. Sounds good. I'll get started. By, sa by, by just sauntering over. Hey, if you don't mind me asking, why do you care about this marriage so much in the first place? I thought you didn't care about anything other than fishing. <laughs> Maybe when you finally mature, you'll understand. That's helpful. Look, I'm not about to tell you how to live your life. But I'm about to tell you how to live your life. <laughs> but I'm not also not gonna let you ruin someone else's either. Kenneth. Oh my. One second, I have to take a drink of water. Diet cold. Humph. Humph diddly humph. <gasps> I would ask you to refrain from talking during a sacred battle such as this. Results are the only thing that matter here. I hope you haven't forgotten that. 
<laughs> My bad, sorry. Time for me to go land Annabelle, the big one. My lady, is something wrong? N not really. It's just that he never seemed to have a care in the world, and yet all this time he was thinking about me. <gasps> he loves you! Meanwhile, I was only ever thinking about myself. I haven't been no uh, showing him the respect he deserves. To him, this battle is a serious affair, and he's fighting with everything he has but me. To me, it was just some t uh, tedious ordeal that I just wanted to have behind me as soon as I could. I'm so ashamed. Th that's nonsense, my lady. I understand how you feel. But save your apologies for later. Right now, the timer says it's 35 minutes. Future editing me has made it less than that. And I don't know how long this video is. Right now, he's over there fishing for what he, what he believes in fighting for you. You're right. I'll leave everything to you, Kenneth. Can't I can believe in you, right? Can't love you. Ah! Uh, three minutes are up. It's time for me to fish this to finish this, Kenneth. Round two, Captain Bell. Control. Oh, come on! I don't have the desire to do this. I don't have the time. Oh, there it is. I guess since he's using like a really special rod, it's a tad easier to do. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Oh God, that was awful, I hate it. All right, time for me to sit back. It's time for me to sit forward. I got this. I got this. I got this. Come on, dude. I want to finish this fucking quest. Oh, you motherfucker. I should wrap things up here. One second. Readjusting myself on the couch. I'd really get into it. The defector is decided. You did it, Kenneth. Well done, Kenneth. Preposterous. Twaddle caught. What? This cannot be happening. It can, and it did. I gave your bouts my all. And, uh, or about my all. And I was still defeated. I have no qualms with accepting the outcome. But. No buts. Fuck, and I did this shit. You accept your defeat. You cannot apologize enough for betraying your trust, Lady Annabelle. However, I believe I have no other choice. I have to request that our engagement be called off. Uh, oh! Are you sure? You seemed dead set on going ahead with it before. Duels such as these put the very honor of the nobility on the line. The result has been determined, and I must now follow it. Besides, I believe there is a man far more worthy of your hand than me. Ha! Huh. It's Kenneth! Narcissus, we're leaving. But very well. Then we shall make our aggressor... Wait, our aggressor... I bid you all good day. Is he just making up words? Are those actual words? Those are not actual words. <laughs> At least aggressor is not. I'm t I googled it. I wanted to know. This is important to me. Words are important to me. They're hard. They're hard to read sometimes when you're tired. And your brain is a wasteland. 
All right, continuing. I just wanted to say that I had fun fishing with you again today. Are you sure you're okay with this? Why would I not be? I gave it my all, I leave satisfied. <laughs> and you say I haven't changed. But, what's the plan now? I'm guessing Dad's not going to be too happy about this. I intend to return to Crossbell and continue my training there. There's a lady there waiting my return, after all. Is there now? <laughs> wonder if that's who I think it is. Well, give my regards to Kaguya, will you? Humph. On a related note, you would do well to pay more attention to the world around you. If you don't do something about that personality of yours, Annabelle will. No, I suppose it's not my place to say. Regardless, stay diligent in your training. The matter of the wedding may be settled, but our own personal battle rages on. Sure, I'm down to fish any time. <laughs> you really are a sly one. Am I done? Can I go home? I wasn't sure what to make of him at first, but your brother is actually a pretty nice guy, to be honest. Of course. He's my brother, after all. Yeah, he's a little stubborn sometimes, but deep down, he's got a heart as big as the ocean. I almost find myself regretting that the marriage was not meant to be. He seems a rather worthy partner. Yeah, I don't think that's for us to decide, but at least she gets to know. Gets to now. Yeah, good news, right, Annabelle? Well, I... I mean, Kenneth is very charming, but uh, I mean... Annabelle? Yes? What is it? <laughs> Just wanted to say I'm excited that we can go back to spending our days fishing together. M oh. D yes. Uh, I am as well. My lady, forgive me for assuming, but... Have you set your eyes on Kit? D absolutely not! Well, one ordeal's over, but it looks like it led straight into another one. You know what else is over? This damn video! <laughs> Thanks for watching. If you like this video and you want to see more, please do not forget to like, share, favorite, and subscribe, and also press the bell for all notifications. I was doing another video series called Couch Two over the Blizzard for It's super cool and I love it. It's, I do it with a good friend of mine. It's super fun and it's got great content and I like it. And you know what? This is the next episode. I'm going to finish this damn side quest with the General Gut Store. Nailed it. Uh, let's see. Trista Radio. Wherever else I may be. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know where I'm going. I don't know what I'm doing. One second, let me save. All right, cool. Just go, just go throw the controller to the ground. I don't care anymore. That was bullshit. I hated it. I hate fishing in games. I hate fishing in any game. Fishing's bad in Twilight Princess. Fishing's bad here. Fishing's usually bad. Come on, man. Anyways, thanks for watching. See you next time. Goodbye. Really enjoyed my time here. Really enjoyed my time with Bye. Kenneth. He's a really nice guy. My mind's still a complete wasteland right now. Oh. It could play- oh, are you going to run into me again? Alright. It could play home to- to an apocalypse novel. Oh. Uh. 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 I hate it! I hated this! Oh, it hurts. Right. Uh, I have to turn off the video now. <laughs> okay. Uh, uh, bye.